you ever made fettuccine alfredo at home? It's really easy and it only calls for like three ingredients. I'm gonna share a recipe with you today that's really fantastic but very, very rich. So save it for special occasions. Cook your pasta, a pound of fettuccine in a pot of very nicely salted boiling water. Cook it till it's al dente according to the package directions on your box. It's usually about 11 or 12 minutes. Give it a stir once it gets into the boiling water and then just stir it every once in a while so it doesn't stick together. While the pasta's cooking, you can get your sauce ready. You might freak out a little bit when this part happens because you need two sticks of room temperature butter and a half a pound of grated Parmesan cheese. It seems excessive, but this is what makes fettuccine Alfredo so amazingly fantastic. It's rich and delicious. Some recipes use heavy cream. This one doesn't have heavy cream in it, just plenty of cheese and butter. I'm starting off by mixing it a little bit with my rubber spatula, but then I'm gonna beat it to get it nice and creamy with a mixer. I'm pre-mixing it because I'm a little afraid the cheese is gonna fly all over the place. I mean, it's flying all over the place now. I was right. Turn it on, slowly. Cheese and butter together needs to be fully combined. I suppose you could do this by hand without an electric mixer if you wanted to. A little bit of this with ham and some mustard, yum. That seems to be enough. It's all fully combined. Pasta should be ready. Save a half a cup of the pasta water and then drain your pasta. Back in the pot, then add your cheese mixture. It's equal parts cheese and butter to pasta. It's a delicious, delicious dish. Stir, stir, and then add about a quarter of a cup of that pasta water that you save. You can always add more, but you can't take it out, so don't overdo it in the beginning. Over sort of a medium, medium low heat, stir everything together. You want the cheese and butter to melt and coat your pasta and become a sauce with that pasta water. This is so good. A little bit more of that pasta water I think would be good. Wanna season it with some pepper. This is so incredible, you guys. You're not gonna believe it. I'm tasting it because who could possibly wait? Hmm. Wow, it's really good. Honey, a bit more pasta water and then you're done. That's it, that's fettuccine alfredo if you can believe it. This is so rich and fantastic. I don't think you'll need more than just a little bit and it's a great way to start like a fancy meal, say for New Year's or Christmas. A little goes a long way and that long way is gonna be ultra, ultra enjoyable because this is one fantastic three ingredient dish. Enjoy.